Hey everybody, this is Don over Johnny's Used Cars. Today I'm showing this 2007 Mazda Xella Sport Wagon that just came in. It's got 69,000 kilometers on it, which is about 43,000 miles. Before we get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you're seeing on the website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving in Okinawa soon or you just arrived, please make sure you stop by Johnny's Used Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get yourself a driver's license, there are benefits to doing it that way. So with that, let's go ahead and take a look around. We'll show the features inside. But first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos. I'm going to answer a lot of your questions. So things like the JCI, the warranty, the financing. I cover all that and more. So please bear with me until the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. This Mazda Excella is a five-passenger vehicle in the 300 series category. So the larger category. Road tax per year is going to be 19,000 yen, which is about uh, 150 bucks right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May time frame. So we'll take every for you this year. You want it to wait until April or May. I do have two options to pay for it. First one being US dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount. Or you can take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want to put something down, reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. A lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. Totally up to you. Before we go inside, two things I want to show you. First one being the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature of everything is give you that cross ventilation. Get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. The second, it does have the slots here uh, that if you want to put roof racks or crossbars on, you can do that as well. All right, so let's jump on in. Get the baby started. All righty, let's uh, go up a little bit. All right. 69,271 on the odometer. Show you a couple of uh, warning lights. Obviously that one right there is your uh, seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. And that one right there is your emergency brake. It's not a low pressure tire gauge. So this one is a hand brake. So when you uh, disengage it goes away, engage it comes right back on. Other than that, it's a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. I think pops up on the dash while you're driving. Please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off the left here, you do have this monitor. This one does not have a rear camera. Then you have a little display, it's gonna show you the time and uh, radio settings and your air, air conditioning settings. You have your radio, air conditioning controls, power outlet, ashtray, uh, shifter, remote for the uh, monitor up there, um, your handbrake and cup holders. And you also have this armrest slash uh, console. First one, you can have a little tray here. Hey, what's this thing? It says Excella. And then you do have a compartment under there for more storage. Off to the left here, you do have your two-tier uh, glove box. So you have your manuals here, and then it goes all the way back for extra storage. And then um, storage and cup holder on each door panel. This is, or that is your passenger space over there. You got your red rope flare hanging out. Then this is the space I have on my side. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. And the seat is all the way back, all the way down. Um, I could drive as is or slide this up a couple inches and still be comfortable driving. Uh, that's my eye level right there. I don't know why this is looking so dark all of a sudden. Um... Yeah, eye level. Really can't say anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles. All right. Now, normally I take this time to show you the auction sheet showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Please keep that in mind. Non-accident vehicle from mainland. But because it just came in, I keep those inside the uh, office until it's been detailed. Once it's been detailed, I'm going to put it up here on the sun visor on the driver's side. Okay. So I'll show you a couple other things before we go to the back seat. Uh, this guy over here hanging out that's your etc reader that's an electronic toll collector this works like easy pass in the states if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway here okay and then off to the right here uh this controls the illumination of the dash a uh, little compartment here made for some uh, uh coins or whatnot and then your hood release please don't forget on the floor here you do have your gas cover release and then on the door you have your mirror window and door lock controls all right there okay turn this off let's go to the back seat Okay, let's jump on inside. I don't know what that is. It's, what is that? I don't know. All right, so the uh, seat all the way back, all the way down. I'm about a half inch away from the back seat to uh, my knees. Uh, uh, nothing as far as storage on the back of the driver's seat, but you do have pocket storage on the back of the pass seat. As always, be careful what you put in there. You don't want to rip it on each end. And then you have a little uh, compartment here for a cup holder on each door panel. And this will do, or this one does have an, an armrest that does stay level, which I like. Okay, let's go to the back. So your space back here. Right. 
It's a really decent space back here. You do have this privacy cover that can come out by uh, detaching it here and it pops out uh, if you have to haul stuff. And then uh, you can put the seats down and they will lay flat if you push those buttons and that'll go flat as well. All right, let's go to the front here. We're gonna wrap this video up. Okay. And there you have it. This one is a pretty sure a two liter. Yeah, this is a two liter engine which will be cleaned during the detailing process, okay? Let me just double check on that. Yes, definitely a two liter. Okay, so there you have it. Um, now I forgot the 69,000, yeah. 2007 Mazda Excella Sport Wagon, 69,000 kilometers on it, which is about 43,000 miles. Military price goes down to 4,500, with additional military discount, we'll get it down to 4,300. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on the lot discounts, and you will get a lower price on this. But for now, the 4300 will include a two-year JCI, the one-year bumper up upper warranty, the remainder of the 2022 road tax, and a 10% sales tax is already included. The only thing on top is going to be the American insurance requirement, whether they go liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Touching on these warranties real quick, yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best thing since sliced bread, so don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. But we do encourage you to shop around, go to the dealer, see what they have, but definitely stop by Johnny's Used Cars. Let us show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we can assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. Stop by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. So don't forget, two ways to pay for it, U.S. dollars cash out rate. We're taking advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Either way, we're good to go. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.